What's up, YouTube? So I'm back. I'm gonna do a uh, another review. I'm Josh from Bearded Assassins. Um, anyway, so I told you guys, I think two videos ago, that I would do a like an update video whenever I had uh, the new uh, like patches and koozies and stuff like that. So I thought this would be a great time to sit down and have a pipe and tell you a little bit about a company and a blend that I've been smoking for the last few days and which has been really good. So if you're interested and you want to see all this great stuff, stay tuned. We'll be right back. Okay, so I do want to um, let you guys know that we do have new stuff in our shop online. You can find everything at beardedassassins.com. This is one of the new things. That's going to be our new patch. And uh, it's about a two and a half inch patch. Um, I'll end up getting bigger ones, either three or four inch, a little bit larger ones. Um, and then tonight, I also have the koozie. So that is two new things uh, we do offer uh, in the shop as of right now. Um, I do want to let you guys know that we will be <clears throat> um, get rid of I think four four or five different scents that we do have. We're going to go ahead and get rid of them. Just downsize. Um, we may add new scents later on. We don't know yet. <clears throat> anyway, so tonight what I'm smoking this is a Dagner This is a Dagner Bulldog. The Ben Stem. It's gonna be a Diamond Shank. And in it, in it, this is where really what I want to tell you guys about. Centenary. So this is a very mild, I would say a very, very mild um, English blend. Uh, anybody that's new to smoking pipes or something like that, you've been smoking aromatics, you kind of want to see and step into Englishes. Um, for a, um, like a house blend, Centenary from Mylon Tobacconist is a terrific blend, uh, would be a terrific blend for anybody to actually start out on. Smokes really well. So Centenary, I have it pulled up on my on the L Internet O, and I'm gonna read what it is. It, Centenary is a wonderful traditional English blend, reminiscent of pipe tobacco blending recipes used when our store first opened. This blend has a rich taste of hickory with subtleties of nut and wood and a nice proportion of spice on the finish. Fifteen different tobaccos were used to create this complex blend, including a healthy dose of Latakia, but we think you'll agree the result is well worth it. So, I, I, I kind of want to get into this because... Sorry about that, my, uh, my card I guess was full on the on the camera for the video so I had to uh, erase some stuff so anyway centenary so it says it has a healthy low um, a healthy dose of Latakia it does have some Latakia I wouldn't say it's a healthy dose but it's a very very good balance uh, it's not gonna be overwhelming to anybody that's new to pipe smoking or uh, new to English at all um, 
it's almost like uh, Frog Morton, but not near as sweet. If that, I think Frog Morton is one of the best Englishes to get into. It's it still has that sweetness about it, but it still has smokiness and stuff like that and the earthiness. This doesn't have such a high scent of like a campfire like the normal high Latakia blends wood. But you can definitely taste the wood. You can definitely taste the hickory. Um, and, and it does leave um, not a film but a, a, a taste on your tongue that is inviting for the people that like English blends. Um, if you want to try something that's going to burn, burn really well it's burning really really well it's going to be nice white ash, gray ash, whatever you want to call it. It's one of those blends that it will smoke really well for even the beginner. It packs really well. Uh, you may have to relight it a few times, but the taste, the taste is phenomenal. Um, on their website, you can either get an ounce for $375 or you can get a half of a pound for $26.95 or a full pound for $42.95 so they're really 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 priced reasonably the shipping on your order no matter what it is big or small it's going to be about 10 bucks um, so the next time that I order I'm going to order half a pound of this because this is really freaking good um, the wife actually doesn't mind this English It's not overwhelmingly strong as a scent, like I said before. So you can possibly get away from smoking in the house. I smoke in the house anyway. Um, only pipes and cigars are allowed in the house, obviously. I don't smoke cigarettes uh, anymore. Um, and any, I, I want to say this. Anybody that is a, that used to be a, a, a cigarette smoker, Every once in a while, I'll, ha I'll get that urge to want that tobacco-y taste. This blend gives that to me. It satisfies that need. Um, so a lot of people, whenever they get into Englishes and stuff like that, I think they have a, it's going to taste nasty or it's going to taste weird. But if you smoke cigarettes before and you ever get that urge, this will definitely give you satisfaction on that end of it and if not it's just a really easy nice subtle smoke um, I, I would call this an Aldi smoke so that is my review on Centenary I hope you enjoyed again here's the information And the people over there are totally awesome. You can either call and talk to them. And like I don't necessarily love Burley. So I actually called them. Talked to them and said hey I want something. You know I want some of your blends. But I don't want something with a high amount of Burley. So this is actually one of them that doesn't have a, a high amount of Burley. So I think that's why I'm actually. I, I like I like this one. Um. But all their other tobaccos, I've had a lot of their tobaccos, and they're all really, really high quality. So go give them a, sh a shout out. Go, um, you know, go find a couple blends that you want to try out. I promise you, you'll have the best customer service. You and you will have just a really great experience with them. So until we can meet again, have a nice bowl, sweet smokes, and have a great night.